Uh, my name is Matt Silver Valens. Uh, I am attaching myself to 200 helium filled balloons and floating from Robben Island to the mainland of Cape Town to, with the aim of raising 10 million rand for the Nelson Mandela Children's Hospital. The real kind of driving force behind it was that I was a, a paramedic uh, on the Western Cape Ambulance Service and had the experience of interacting with the Red Cross Children's Hospital because it's incredible that there are only four paediatric hospitals in the whole of Africa. Logistically, it's quite, it's quite simple in that you attach yourself to a bunch of balloons. They have a lifting force of 200 kilograms, about 110 kilos. Then I'll have equipment weighing about 40 kilograms and then literally water bottles of about 50 kilograms. So you create an equilibrium. 200 kilograms downwards force, 200 kilograms upwards force. And then I will literally pour out half a, half a litre of water and gently float up. And then to land, or, or, so I'll float up to about 600 feet. And then I'll have a pellet gun. I'll also have a, a long bamboo stick with a blade on the end and just literally pop a balloon and then slowly go down. And then when I want to go up again, pour a little bit of water out and then so I'll, I'll literally oscillate. We'll only fly uh, in the right weather conditions and the three, weather, the three criteria are a wind between 310 and 230 degrees. So that's a, a northwester, a wester or a southwester. As long as we've got a westerly component, we'll be floating towards the mainland. Then the two things that we have to avoid are Cape Town International Harbour, because that's a flight restricted zone, and nuclear, the Kuberg nuclear power station, because that's also a flight zone. So basically, we've got the island, the power station, the harbour, and then we have to float in between those. Um, 